Hello and welcome to Discovering Desire to Learn. Today we will be going over what is user progress and how to use it effectively. User progress, also known as completion tracking, is an easy to use way for students to view how they are progressing on course activities. This is a handy tool for keeping track of your various assignments as well as your completion of course tasks. User progress measures many different components. You can view user progress information on grades, objectives, content, discussions, drop boxes, quizzes, checklists, and surveys. For example, I can see my progress on how many topics within the table of contents that I have completed and how many more I have left. You will also notice a check mark next to items that have been viewed or completed and a dot next to items that still need to be completed. To see your progress in relation to the course as a whole, click on the Assessments tab and then User Progress. Here you will find both the summary and in-depth analysis of your course completion. Not only can you see the completion report, but you will also see how long you spent and your login history. While User Progress can be a great tool to stay ahead in class, it can be misleading if misinterpreted. Some classes are set up with manual tracking. If this is the case, then students must manually select a task and say it is completed before it will show up as completed in user progress. However, other courses use automatic tracking. This is where many students are misguided. In this case, when a user views an item, it is counted as completed. This can prove to be misleading if you open an item but do not do the assignment. It will still be counted as completed. Other professors may disable the tracking tool altogether. If you are not seeing a progress bar, this may be why. Once you discover what type of tracking your course is using, you'll be on your way to tracking like an all-star. Good luck with the user progress throughout the semester, and as always, go green!